Hey guys, so I'm really terrible this week about vlogging. It's not that I don't want to, it's like every time I'm like, oh I should vlog this, and then like, either I get a call, or I have to meet someone, or I'm running late, or I'm running, or <laughs> I need to get somewhere, or anything like that, so I'm really sorry about that. Or I get tired, or lazy, or I'm doing something, yeah, I don't know, I've been really like tired this week and I should really be going to bed because it's already 12 so I'll probably just take a shower in the morning um and stuff but I have to get ready pretty early because I'm going with my boyfriend before I go to the eye doctor and I still have to fill out freaking papers that they sent me good thing I know where they are um so yeah but anyways so the first thing I did this morning once I finally woke up because it took me forever to actually like want to get up then I was like oh shit I have my doctor's appointment so I went to the doctors, and, um, and she was really nice, and she ordered lab, like, lab tests for me, and she put me on birth control, because I told her, I'm like, I kind of need to go on there for, my sister's just giving me the look, like, why are you even telling people this? <laughs> but, whatever, you guys probably will find out more things about me than I'm, I ever thought I'd actually share anyway. But, um, just because, like, I get really weird periods and stuff, and they just don't want me to become anemic. And also because, um, of that little pain I told you guys about that I have on my right side, sometimes, um, she said it had, it, it will probably lessen that. And she said it's not like it's not something to worry about, but yeah. So anyway, that's really personal. But anyway, who cares? I probably said stuff on here that slipped out that I don't even realize. When I'm editing, I'll probably figure it out. Um. So yeah. So that is that. And then she also ordered like. Um, she told me I have to go on Claritin year round because of my allergies and she actually sent me to the ENT which is what I needed really badly and um she was really nice so like she was like I mean she was like one of the nicest doctors I've actually gone to and she was really took her time with me and everything and like answered all my questions and she seems she knows her stuff so I'm happy because it took me forever as you guys know to actually look for a doctor and find a doctor and everything um but yeah so she says for my allergy stuff at least, like, until everything gets solved, I have to be year-round on Claritin. But then I told my boyfriend, and I told my boss, and she's like... And they they both were like, why Claritin? You guys, sh you should go on Surtec. Like, Claritin, like, does not work at all. So I think I'm going to take their advice because I have taken Claritin before, and it doesn't work on me either. <laughs> and usually the only allergy medicine that works on me is Benadryl. So, yeah. Um... Uh, my sister's watching Keeping Up with the Kardashians in my room. She, like, just came and was like, Oh, what are you watching? And then she was, like, changing the channels. And now she's here for, like, ever. For the night. Until, like, this is, ends or whatever. She doesn't... Like, there's nothing else to watch on TV. Since we don't have MTV, this is what we do. Um, what's the other thing I'm going to tell you guys? So, yes, yeah, so... And then I got an allergy test ordered and stuff like that. Fun stuff. Being a grown up is so much fun. Um, and then the good thing though is, and I didn't like choose a doctor because of this, but like more because they were nearby, near me, but um, my doctor is like right down the, blo the block from Porto's. I think I told you guys about the bakery place yesterday. Um, so yeah. So I went there after I met my boyfriend. I met up with my boyfriend there because he was working somewhere nearby or like for the jeweler and he finished early. So he's like, yeah, I'll meet you up. Uh, I'll meet up with you. Sorry. I'm really tired. Um, and what else? So yeah, I thought I was going to run into my friend because he works there, but he wasn't there today, so... I, t I Facebooked him, I was like, we need a sushi date, because we keep saying, like, we should go eat sushi, and I used to, that girl from New Year's Eve, I used to go out eat, to eat sushi with her, but now she doesn't want to. I, I mean, not, 
now I don't talk to her anymore, so I need a new buddy. Even though my cousin would, will be like able to go. Oh, by the way, Jersa, did you know Jasmine went to the freaking uh, Rincon Tarina because she was that hungry? I'm like, dude, you could have come to her house. She goes, I know, I could have. She goes, I know that for next time now. So yeah, my cousin was like, oh, I want to, like, she Instagrammed a picture. I was like, I know where that is. It's like literally a block from her house. And I'm like, we're a block away too. You could have come and like not had to waste money on food. And we had like shrimp and stuff and but tuna. That's, that's what I'm saying. That's just like, what would she, what would she get? I guess she's desperate. <laughs> Maybe beans or something. Like, anyways, like we have beans at home. We're freaking Mexican. There's always beans and rice. Although my mom doesn't always make it all that great, but yeah, that's another thing. Um. So yes, so I went to Portos, and then my boyfriend. Keep calling him my boyfriend, even though you guys know his name's Michael. Um, we went to Fry's Electronics because it's like the awesomest place for techies. Pretty much all the Best Buy is, like, really close, too. But, yeah, we went because I was like, oh, well, he needed to look for a scanner that he, like, the people at Best Buy took forever looking up and they never came back to him about. Um, but also because I needed a router because my sister and my dad's computers and my mom's tablet never hook up correctly to the computer. Like, there's, like, we always have to restart the freaking um, router and then it works and then even then like sometimes it won't work and they won't get a connection so um, I talked to my boyfriend he's like it might be the router and I'm like you know what you might be right so we went to go get um, with Mike we went to go get a new router so it's somewhere it's the, new, the one with the green light and the blue light so got that at Fry's and I also got computer cleaner because my computer is a freaking mess because I every time I try to clean it I I realize we're out of the cleaning liquid thing yeah the liquid thing cleaner um screen cleaner so I bought that too but and now your connection seems to be better and my dad's just like yeah I had no problem connecting to the internet and my mom's tablet actually was what I tested once I got home again, um, so yeah, because I came back home after fries, I was like, okay, okay, see you later, um, but he told me, he's like, yeah, this is what you have to do, like, I'm like, cool, and he walked me through that, it's nice having a boyfriend who knows his shit about computers, um, what the hell, these jeans are weird, so, yeah, and then I went to work, and with Dempsey, and Dempsey was really obsessed with the violin guy that always is at the bookstore. Or by the bookstore, like he always plays outside, so she's like waving at him and then whatnot. And she got a hula hoop from a birthday party. And then she keeps thinking my little ca uh, phone holder is a camera. She makes me say, smile, cheese, okay, now take a deep breath. Oh, that was a great job. This is what we hear in the car every day now. Um, so yeah, so there was that. And then I also um, supported this uh, equal rights thing. You guys know I'm like really into the gays. Which I know sounds like a really bad way to put it now that I realize it. But I'm really into supporting the gay, the L... LBGC... No. L B G T Q. L G B T Q. L G B T Q. I always mess up which letters go first, so yes. L B G T Q. I want fucking food. I kind of want food too. I want like a cupcake. I want like. But I want to go to the kitchen and not get something unhealthy because I'm actually trying to eat healthier. I want some fries and a really cold coke. Yeah, I've been <sighs> so good about what I eat. I haven't even eaten you know when you said that? I'm like, do we have time to go to In N Out? <laughs> oh my god, dude. Dude, I'm so down. I'm <sighs> I shouldn't. But I'm, I kinda want it now. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> I 
if you guys don't live on the west coast, I feel so bad for you <laughs> when it comes to burgers. Although I heard there's like other burger joints, but still. Sonic, they have Sonic. On the east coast? People have Sonic and like DQ, so. Well, I think DQ, no, I think DQ is still kind of west coast and so is Sonic. Maybe Fat Burger. No, I think Fat Burger's West Coast too. Dude, Fat Burger fries. I guess it's a West Coast thing. Tom, no, Tommy's Mighty Mouth sounds good right now. Mighty Mouth, yes. I know this sounds like a Chuck E. Cheese place, and that's what I always think of when I think of Mighty Mouth, but it, no, it's like when I went to high school, there was Taco Bell and Mighty Mouth. And most people went to Mighty Mouth. And it was this burger joint right by my school. It's like seriously like in back of my school. Where everyone would use as a hangout. And you got the best chili cheese fries. Best. And Even if you don't like chili yeah. cheese fries, you'll like them. Yes. I don't really I don't really care for chili cheese anything except mm -hmm. for Fritos. Um, but that's like completely different. But like chili cheese dogs from like uh, what is that place called? Wiener Snitchel? Ew. That disgusts me. Like, that, I cannot stand that. But the chili fries from Mighty Mouth are, like, the bomb.com. And Tommy's. Tommy's chili fries are pretty good. But Mighty Mouth but, are Yeah, because the thing is, Tommy's makes them, like, too thick, their fries. I don't like their fries. And then I went to this other place that had somewhat decent oh, chili fries. Oh, vanilla shake. Oh, How about the shake? But animal style fries right now. A four by four. A, oh. a four by four. Dude, a, I I can't finish a four by four. I can finish double double. I want a cheeseburger now. And we live right by a Burger King, so we could really easily go get a burger anyway. Oh no, I like uh. In that. Uh. I love how this discussion went. Oh, I like the tender grill uh chicken something something from Burger King because they have it on that new bread. Uh. Yes, and they have like this whole deal thing going on this week. It was like the midday, the midweek deal, the something deal. It was like something for like cheap. So yeah, you can obviously tell now we have the munchies. So yeah. Um. Anyway, so back to Dem to my day at work. So Dempsey was pretty good. Um, and I like I said I was supporting. Um, it's um, EQ California. I think I got that right. But basically, um, what they're trying to do is they're like one of the biggest supporters um, or organizations for that cause. Um, for supporting gay rights and everything. So basically, there's a law. It's they're trying to ban um, conversion therapy in California. Okay. And conversion therapy is basically like people who really, like, they, they make these programs or therapies where, like, they, they think that they convert, convert a gay person back to, like, a normal person. Oh, I hate that shit. Like, and it's not, like, just, like, for, like, people, like, who are super religious, but there's, like, actually people, like, you know, like, they think that, like, it's just, like, like, they can convert you back to, like, you know, the right way and everything. And I think that's of absolutely, like, bullcrap, because, like, I mean, the way I, I see it is you don't, like, I honestly do believe people are born gay, because, like, why would people choose to become gay and go through the, the pain, ridicule. like the like discrimination and hate crimes, and you know not being accepted by their own family members, um, you know, and basically like I mean they don't ask for that. Like I mean like I don't think anyone would. Just like anyone who like you know has this discriminated by race doesn't like ask like I want to be born white or I want to be born like this, you know, color or whatever. So, I, like, that's why I fully support that. And so they, but there's, like, a, I think it's called a NARTH, is a, the group she mentioned, is fighting hard to actually um, keep from this ban from passing. Like, they're against the equal right, the equal rights movements, um, or gay rights movements. Um, 
so yeah but I was like you know what yeah I will support you because I have various friends who are gay and sometimes I even like catch myself I'm like why did I just say that like that sounded like so you know discriminating and stuff um you know I think like it's kind of hard sometimes not to like say something wrong though because like you know you live in a society that still kind of has like certain slangs and everything although I try not to, I try not to use a lot of the stuff or you know you're still like oh like he's gay like oh, okay because you're just raised like to into thinking that everyone's you know straight or whatever but so sometimes you're like oh I didn't know he was gay I know that one did get really soft the other one though got like so disgusting sorry we're talking about makeup brushes now yeah yeah Good thing I don't use that much powder or like. Ew, you need a kabuki. I do have a kabuki. What? No, why do you use this? Huh? No, what do you use this for? I don't really use it. Why I just want. Shouldn't? Well, because I couldn't. It's horrible quality. It is. So, yeah, I'll do, I'll do the, that review on my makeup channel, which I haven't done a video for in a while, but um, that's actually a really good thing to do it on. I have a few review stuff and then I can get into the actual looks. So yeah, anyways, going back to my day. So there was that, and then I took her back home and um, made her pasta, and we were having fun, and she was like, she was being completely silly and stuff. And then I came home. I tried going to the bank to deposit my checks from Jessica, and my freaking pen is out of ink, and all I can find are pencils. And the, the bank, it's like the outside ATMs, so there's no pen around. I'm like, ugh, I'm so mad. I'm like, I kind of need to deposit money. Um, so I have to do that early in the morning, too, so I really should go to bed. I don't think I'm going to take, I'm thinking, you know, I'm just going to wake up and take a shower, because if I take a shower now, I'm going to totally wake up, and then it's going to be worse for me. Um, so, yeah, and then I came home, and I was watching a little bit of TV, and I was looking up through my emails and whatnot, and I did kind of put some magazines away, so I kind of cleared my desk, but not really, and, um... Yeah, and then now I'm going to go to bed. So, anyways, I know the good thing about filming these one, like, you know, kind of, like, at the very end, like, don't forget to vlog things is um, that I take everything in one take, so it's really easy to edit. But I still, like, prefer to film throughout the day. So I'll try to do that um, tomorrow. I have an eye doctor appointment, and I don't know what else. Um... So yeah, anyways, I will see you guys tomorrow or later today, really. So don't forget to comment and like and subscribe. Good night.